Um, welcome. This is uh, we're in the Women in Engineering Week, and this is our group project for Mud and Flyer, Fire. These guys are doing an analog model of a volcanic trash can. Um, so at the moment, we're working on uh, what is a volcanic uh, uh, hazard, and so they're thinking about where is safe and working on mapping. Um, so at the moment, if you look over here, you can see the students. They're they're actually uh, putting their communities down and then they're going to think and evaluate and predict which ones are in safe zones and which are the volcanic hazards that'll happen. And then we're going to use an analog model of an exploding trash can which is using liquid nitrogen to blow up and we're hoping for two gigantic explosions today. So have some fun! Which type of dangers they might be in? So maybe some of these are more likely to be a lahar flow, some of these might more likely to be in, in a uh, problem for something like a pyroclastic flow. So just list all the communities and then rank them. Zero means no danger, 10 means oh my gosh, why did the community there? Okay? Probably do that. Is that good enough for you? The bottle blew out of it. Yeah. Oh, you can leave them there. They're actually our evidence. We're mapping those. Okay, thank you. We're going to map those. So, I guess it. That's okay, no problem. It ejected the magma chamber. The whole magma chamber's gone. Well, we look at it. Oh, yes. We definitely want. Was your prediction correct? Why or why not? So, we can see that we definitely have spray everywhere, and there's a bit of lava flow. See that lava flow? It's still moving down. Why is it moving over there? Slope. And, and it's also, what would these be like in real life? Why would they run along these? Yeah, like stream channels, right? All right, so we're going to finish our maps. We've seen what happens when we have a second, we have evidence for a second type of explosion. So go ahead and draw the maps. This